right, Kill, so you had a big assist out there uh, for the go-ahead goal. What were you guys seeing on that play? Yeah, just uh, we had control there on the power play and uh, seemed it to Sweets there, and he made a good play uh, cross ice seam again, just try to get to the net, and Painter was in a good area and just buried the rebound. So with that assist, you had a goal and two assists last night. You've now got points in six out of your last seven games. Just what are you and your line mates seeing out there on the ice right now? Yeah, I think we're, uh, we're just talking and we're just uh, being patient. Uh, we got a lot of time out there and uh, just trying to go to the net and make the simple plays and get pucks to the net and support each other and uh, just talk and uh, be supportive down low and uh, help out when we can. And lastly, what do you guys need to do to come out with that third win tomorrow night? Yeah, I think we just got to, uh, it's going to definitely be the hardest win for sure. Just got to play the same game, uh, play full 60 and just get pucks in, get pucks out and play simple and uh, finish bodies and try and wear them down. All right, Coach, so first off, just give me your thoughts on the game. Uh, we came out really well. Um, you know, we wanted to carry that pace from Wednesday night into tonight, and I thought we executed that well. Um, the urgency on our power play uh, in the first period was really good and, you know, was able to get us on the board with two quick ones. So, um, you know, that, that, that was big for us. So uh, it was a good game. Um, you know, that's two, uh, two in a row here uh, against a very good KC team. And now it's just important that uh, we stay small pitcher, stay humble, and make sure we're ready uh, to come back tomorrow. So it was another big night for the penalty kill unit. Just continue to play at a top level. What have you been seeing from those guys? They, they were great. You know, the fact, uh, um, you know, the message has been clear that they've bought into it. They're sacrificing it, and they're making really good reads. So, um, you know, we found some pretty good PK rotation and PK, uh, um, you know, personnel. And the thing is, we have a lot of guys that can play it. Um, you know, but we have some of our older guys stepping up on the PK right now, and they're doing an outstanding job. So, um, you know, when the PK can do a job like that, and then the power play gets two any night, um, you know, you're going to put yourself on the right side of things. Let's talk about the job that you have to decide just keeping the puck away from the net. I thought they did a really good job, you know, especially through the first two. Um, you know, the nine shots they had for the most part were fairly perimeter, and I thought we did a good job of getting pucks off their sticks uh, in dangerous areas. So, um, you know, they did a good job. A lot of guys stepped up, you know, especially, um, you know, we didn't have Dodaro in the lineup tonight. Uh, and then Chris Field, uh, he had to get evaluated there mid third. Um, so we had Alex Dahl step back there for the third period, and he did a great job. And um, so the fact that we had guys kind of in and out and new pairings, uh, it's always tough on the back end when you juggle the pairs a bit, but I thought the guys responded great. So what do you guys need to do to come out and take this last one of three tomorrow night? Well, you know, I, I think, you know, again, looking at the, the pace we came out with today, um, you know, the puck support, you know, we were connected uh, in all three zones. And, um, you know, when guys are playing that way and you have options, um, you know, we did a nice job of finding the open man. So that's something we got to carry into tomorrow. But um, I like our energy. I like our enthusiasm. And I, I think that's been uh, a real key for us so far.